welcome back to the channel and thank you for tuning in today is the day we are finally going to be unveiling to you guys the car for our fast and furious integra this car is a 1996 integra ls and uh without further ado guys here's the b-roll So before we get started, I want to give a big thanks to Dennis Newland, who is the one who helped me find this car. He also purchased it for me and held on to it for about a week or so until I was able to make the trip down to St. Louis to pick it up. So huge thanks to Dennis. But uh, so far from you guys, as you guys can see, this car is really clean. There's absolutely no, oh, there's a little bit of rust, but nothing too major. We have a little bit of damage here on the front bumper that we can do some body work to get that out as well as probably just replacing this fender as it's bent in and is starting to rust. I think it'd just be easier to find a new one. Um, you come back here, we have a little bit of rust bubbling back here by the rear wheel well. That can be easily fixed. This car is also starting to kind of fade towards the top, so we'll probably we'll need a respray. And then coming back here, the clear, the clear coat starting to fail on the rear bumper which is fine because this is gonna have a rear lip that will be attached to it so we can get that all paint matched at that time. And then on this side, we have a little bit more rust by this rear wheel well as well where it's starting to bubble, which will be a quick fix as well because it's just a little bit of body work, which is not too bad. And then if we jump into the inside, the interior is really clean. Unfortunately, it is an automatic, so expect a manual swap here in the near future. But other than that, everything in here is in really good condition, and which is great, but at the same time, we're also gonna be swapping those seats for those Momo seats, so it's not a big deal at the end of the day. Now, we move up here to the engine bay. It is all really stock, which is nice for us because we don't have to do a lot of removing of aftermarket parts that somebody else had put on here and it allows us to make it movie accurate, which is gonna be our plan here. Obviously this is the B18 and the movie one was a GSR which had the B20, but there is a thing that we can do where we swap the, basically the top of the motor to make it that B20 engine, which will make it movie accurate for us. So overall this car is in really great shape and it's gonna be the perfect donor for our Fast and Furious Integra replica build guys. And I hope you guys are excited for this one as much as we are. That really about does it with the Integra today. We're gonna get this pushed back over. I have a couple parts that I'm gonna take with me to go get some quotes from powder coating companies to try and get those parts ready for this car. And then uh, we're also gonna make a trip to home or to Menards because we need another propane tank. So let's get this pushed back over here. Let's get the rest of these cars back inside and then let's head to Menards.
Guys, so we finally were able to get all these cars in here. Me and Justin were struggling for quite some time to get that Mustang in here, but huge thanks to our neighbor Woody. He came through, helped us push that in there, and it literally took like two seconds after we were just struggling for like an hour, but it's fine. It's we fine. appreciate we're all it, good. Woody. Yeah, Woody, if you see this, we appreciate you, and uh, we support you. <laughs> but uh, uh, that basically is about it for today's video, guys. We got some pizza we're gonna eat, and then we're also gonna be moving on to uh, working on the Mustang for another installment in our Mustang build series. So that pretty much does it for the Integra video, but uh, we hope you guys enjoyed it and are excited for that build to get started because a lot of you have been DMing me wanting me to get going on that, and that is finally moving forward, guys. So uh, be on the lookout for those videos. Make sure to turn on your post notifications when the, so you can get updated when those videos go live. But for now, guys, thank you so much for watching. And we'll see you in the next one. And then tell me to <laughs> watch.